I'm so used to drinking now. So when I say that I'm not going to drink, I can still drink a beer because I don't think beer is considered drinking. Am I the only one or am I just an alcoholic? Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. Those of you are here, my name is Kenz and if you're new to this channel, thank you for stopping by and if you enjoy any of my videos, any of my content, please stay and subscribe and also hit the notification bell so you can be notified whenever I post a video. I do makeup and perfume here on this channel so if you're interested in any of those please subscribe so today I'm going to do a, a tag video I am late to this video but better late than sorry or is it better late than never yeah so it's a tag video and Takara Thompson, she tagged me in this video and I think Rebecca was the one, so Rebecca Colazzo, I think she was the one that was the one that came up with the idea for this tag, if I'm not mistaken. So go by her channel, subscribe if you like her content, like her videos, you know, just support. Also, please do check out Takara Thompson's video, I will have both lovely ladies listed down below. So the tag is top eight fragrances for each season and I must say I was pretty stressed about picking these day and night. Um, let me just put a disclaimer out guys I don't wear fragrances according to seasons. I live on an island as luxurious as that sounds. I live in the Caribbean so it's always hot i wear sweet fragrances mostly it i don't have a problem with wearing sweet fragrances in the hot climate uh that's all i do i don't wear fresh citrus or too floral fragrances so most of my fragrances here are sweet so i just wanted to put that out there my collection consists of mostly sweet fragrances okay so yeah so top eight fragrances for day and night. I just picked the ones that I thought would work best if I had to put it to a season. You get me? So that's what I did. Uh, I think this fragrance just embodies spring. Um, I've mentioned it. I've mentioned all of these maybe once or twice here on this channel for spring daytime is Flor Botanica Balenciaga and this is a fresh florally green fragrance. So it's fresh, it has cannabis, has mint, it's it's green, it's very, it's fucking, it's, did I, was I about to curse? I swear to you, I just started drinking and beer can drink me. So I'm not know about what I come from a while ago. Anyways, so this is a fresh, I think I want this to be my scent for the night because I miss smelling like this. So. This is a very green fragrance. It's florally, it has mint in there. It, it's very, very green. Like it's very, very green and it's, it screams spring to me. When I think about spring and a fragrance from my collection, this is the one that I go with for Botanica by Balenciaga. Guys, also I'll list every fragrance down below. I'll also leave a link for the notes down below because I'm not going to talk about like the main accords and the notes for these fragrances because I don't want it to be a completely long video but you guys know my love for this fragrance and how I feel about this fragrance so again this is Balenciaga by Flora Botanica by Balenciaga okay so for spring night time now this one was a little bit harder than spring this one this one was a little harder than spring day you know because when I think of spring I think about Balenciaga but this one's a little harder. I wanted something deep enough for the night, but also spring strong, spring heavy, spring vibes. So for that, I chose one of my new fragrances. I just think this is for spring night in my opinion, spring evening to night, this is what I would wear. Uh, I chose the Lena Exclusive by Parfums to Miley. Um, this is, this, I mean, I would wear this all year round but if I had to choose a specific season I think I would choose spring 
this has rose incense does it have oil again i'll put the, the, the notes down below <sighs> yeah for my spring night is the lena exclusive so yeah this is a florally rose sweet lychee fragrance a slight fruity like yeah yeah okay so next we have summer um and for summer i didn't want to pick you know a tropical fragrance or a fresh fragrance you know summer is pretty pretty hot especially here in jamaica but i didn't want to choose anything too tropically coconutty you know you had you have rebel, you have rebel flurry you have miami glow by jlo those were good choices even yeah even versace versens those are great summer fragrances but for me and if i were to choose from my collection my top fragrances and a season towards those fragrances for my summer fragrance i would definitely choose i mean it's an all year round fragrance for me but i love it so much i would have to apply it in this video so this is Mongolan by Guerlain and this is my summer pick, summer daytime pick. This has vanilla, lavender. It, as I said in many of my videos, this is a very intimate fragrance but it also has projection. Um, I have to choose the ones that I love from my collection and I chose Mongolan for summer day. This could have been any other season but I chose it for summer. I mean I've worn this out in the heat and it performed and it performed really really well so for my summer pick daytime I chose Mongolan by Guerlain now for my summer night the fragrance that I would choose for summer night is La Belle from Jean-Paul Gaultier yeah this feels like it's summer night so it has three notes pear vetiver and vanilla I mean this can be another fragrance that is all year round but i'm picking the ones that you know i really really love in my collection also that i think matches to me my opinion my body my fragrances and my feelings so i'm picking the ones that i would wear on these occasions so yeah for summer night i would choose la belle by jean paul gautier it's sweet it's not too sweet it's kind of green it's it's long lasting as and yeah it's wonderful if i had to categorize it i think i would put it at summer night um it could be summer day also but i think i'd like it more for summer nights so again this is la belle jean paul gautier so the next season we have is fall autumn and for this for these fragrances these are sweet i think in the colder times that's when you draw for the gourmands the sweet the chocolatey the nutty the vanilla -y, the praline -y. like these are the time to now draw for these fragrance okay so for my autumn pick for daytime it's a sweet fragrance it's a sweet fragrance but it's not too 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 cloying sweet it's not too sweet um i wish it was sweeter to be honest I would choose Porfem by Dolce & Gabbana. It's not too sweet. It's not cloying sweet. I think it's a, an appropriate daytime fragrance. I would never. I, I don't think I would ever wear this in the nighttime. It's sweet, but it's not too sweet. It's. I think this is mass appealing. Um, I don't know, really know how the intense version smells, but I really do want it. I really wish that this had more of a strong marshmallow scent strong marshmallow note um it's nice it has raspberry vanilla marshmallow i think it has some floral i think it has orange blossom in it it's a very nice daytimey scent it's a pretty daytime fragrance that i don't think you can go wrong with to be honest it's nice it's mass appealing it's not too sweet i just wish that marshmallow came through a little bit more but regardless it's a beautiful scent and this is the one that I would choose for my autumn daytime. And this is For Femme by Dolce & Gabbana. Okay, so for fall night, the fragrance I would choose. So now we're going to get into the sweeter, sweeter fragrance from my collection. For fall night, I want something, you know, warm but cozy. 
but yummy um sexy still has longevity has projection and triage something that i me because i'm the one that's wearing it that i would really really love um a fragrance that i would say okay all right a fall fragrance that and the one i chose for that is elisab girl of now Eli Eli girl of now um so this has almonds it has pistachio it also has almond milk patchouli i believe and it has vanilla in it so this is a very nutty sweet fragrance it has projection also has longevity it's cozy it's warm it's comforting you definitely well me i overspray so you can definitely overspray this one i don't think it will come off too choking if you overspray it but this i would choose for autumn for fall night i think it's a beautiful i think it's a beautiful sweet scent if you like sweet fragrances it's very very sweet it's gourmand because you do get that pistachio and the almond and almond milk in there you also get the vanilla when it dries down a little bit more next we have winter and winter when i think of winter i think about christmas winter does consist of christmas so like you know uh in abroad you have winter you know people get snow and stuff like that and snow starts fall from november to like february or january yeah no that not happen. so our winter is basically december full stop period there's no other winter that's it the place breeze blow a little bit and i ate that like you know get none extra just like a little, little more cool breeze not in the day in the night so that's basically winter here in jamaica the place get a little bit a little bit cooler at night um so yeah but when i think of winter i think about christmas i think about festive festivals i think about christmas trees and christmas cake i love christmas cake i love christmas cake anyways i think about christmas cake when i think about christmas I think about all of those things. I think about watching movies, snuggling, cozying up. In Jamaica, we do go parties, but I not think about that. I think about the festive side of Christmas. Because this fragrance, I think, reminds me of Christmas. You know, for some strange reason, some strange reason, this feels like these last two fragrances feels like Christmas to me. They're the most Christmassy in my collection this some would probably think it's a little bit too heavy for the daytime but guys i'm just gonna let you know right now wear your fragrances whenever you want don't mind about Thursday, you can't wear it are you bite i didn't buy it no so don't mind about Thursday, you can't wear perfume when you want to wear it so with that being said this fragrance i chose for winter daytime i chose Ragba by Latifa perfume and this it reminds me of drinking in Christmas that's what it reminds me yeah mm-hmm yeah 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 and it also reminds me of you know those shows I don't know if I can find a picture but you know those shows when the man has their bourbon whiskey in their hands and they lean back in their chair and smoke a cigar in the other hand it also reminds me of that like you know maybe they're having some business talk so two men in separate couches they have whiskey or bourbon in their hands with a cigar in the other and they are by a fireplace and they're talking business not that it, it's remind me, not that it reminds me of a man but it reminds me of the vibe that environment that's what it reminds me of yeah so for winter at daytime this is ragba by latifa perfume and again guys don't let someone tell you that you can't wear fragrance at a certain season a certain time a certain per a certain event yeah just don't make nobody tell you can't wear perfume because one and the only I don't buy it. So, yeah. 
okay so for my last fragrance and this is another fragrance that is winter time same way i mean that smells more like on the festive side of christmas for this but this one smells like everything else so not just the festive part but everything else you know the partying the clubbing the going out the dressing up the being a bad bitch this what is yeah it reminds me of that part of winter you know you dress up you go out you get a little yush party you go a little frenchman party like yeah it reminds me like of like the new year's part of christmas you know the boxing day the parties the coming home snuggling yeah it reminds me of that part of christmas so the fragrance that i chose for this one you may may might you might be tired of hearing about it but i chose shock of food from swiss arabian this is what I choose for my winter night. Yeah. 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 This is what winter is. If I were to, if I had to choose, this is all year for me. But if I had to choose a season for this fragrance, it would definitely be winter. And best believe if the place opens by Christmas and we actually go to parties, I'm wearing this. I'm wearing the heck out of this. I am I'm going to be known for smelling like this. Yeah. Yeah. So for winter night, I chose Shakaf Oud by Swiss Arabian. Okay, guys. So that is it for this video. Let me know your thoughts down below. Also, a question for the day is what is your favorite, your absolute favorite summer fragrance? day or night what is your absolute summer fragrance i'll write that on a pin i'll write that on a comment and pin it to my comments and i want you guys to start a conversation underneath that pin what is your favorite summer fragrance let the girl know so yeah so like this video if you liked this video so i can know that you enjoyed this video and yeah guys let me know your thoughts down below remember tell me your favorite summer fragrance on my pin down below let me know if you made it all the way to the end and like if you liked so yeah guys let me know your thoughts and my name is Kans and those are my two cents